from my point of view, Giggs tried to help me on my music career, yeah. on my path, on my journey. He reached out um, due to the fact I was in jail with one of his brothers. Okay. Um, shout out YG. But um, he reached out and tried to help me on my music journey. And I'll say, you know, due to certain unforeseen circumstances or foreseen circumstances, um, I just couldn't allow myself to take the help. Just in, and I'm not saying that to say, oh, it's fake. Let's have some, because bro, we can do whatever you want to do. I'm outside in the sense of, I've always been outside, bro. And I don't say that to glorify me being outside. I've seen so many rappers face to face. Mm. I've seen so many people face to face. And, and it could have been whatever it could have been. And if it is, it is, if it isn't, it isn't, but I'm outside. So when I bump into these people, we always have cool conversations. You mm. good? Yeah, buddy, good. Issue? No, of course not. All right, cool. It's music, bro. It's, it's competition, bro. So. And I guess on that same yeah. um, album as well, um, not, I don't know, was it that same album or is it there's another tune that I think, or is it when you're doing a diss with Vic and Joel Black? We'll get into that as well. <laughs> but um, you had a few lines for Getz. Yeah, so, all right, okay. So Getz is someone that, salute Getz, yeah? Amazing career, amazing pen. And this is what I'm trying to say about how people can perceive things. Mm. The line I said about Getz, I say about Getz like I'm actually listening, but I think I referenced... Um, Crep's holding my phone. Yeah. Yo, bro. Um, and respectfully, again, like I said, like, yo, bro, um, that conversation that we had, you, you didn't, like, it sounds dumb, but it's like you didn't even want to ask, and I was yeah. confused as to, like, obviously, about to ask me, like, mm. 